In transitioning from drilling to completion, well bore cleanout and fluid displacement can have a significant impact on the quality of the completion, productivity, and profitability of the well. Drilling mud and metal solids that remain in the well bore can lead to formation damage and plugging. Well bore debris is the cause of many failed completions and costly remediation. The benefits from a thorough well bore cleanout pay off and are multiplied many times in deep water operations. Halliburton's Clean Well technology portfolio of tools helps create a smooth transition from drilling to completion operations. Our well bore cleaning solutions can withstand heavy, extensive drilling through any material encountered in the well bore. Additionally, combining multiple cleanout operations on a single trip can save dedicated runs while saving rig time. The Clean Well systems are designed to allow several tasks to be performed in a single trip. A common application is the single trip drill out where cement is drilled to establish plug back total depth and the displacement is performed immediately afterwards. The single trip is performed meeting the cleanout objectives for cleaning and drift assurance. The Drilltech casing scraper stabilizer sleeve ensures the casing drift while the extended blades of the scraper clean the full ID of the casing. The individual Drilltech scraper blades each move independently of each other to ensure maximum contact to the casing ID. The angle of the blades ensure a full 360 degree coverage for both sets of scrapers. This allows the tool to effectively clean with or without rotation. The water course gaps in the drill tech stabilizer sleeves and flow path between the blades ensures that debris is downsized or normalized before continuing up hole. Reducing the size of the debris increases the likelihood of hydraulic debris removal. Ferrous debris in the well is suspended in the drilling fluid and is captured by the MagTech magnet. The MagTech magnet is incredibly strong. It is able to capture and hold small metal fines along with large pieces of metal and can be operated in high temperature applications. The ValleyTech filter includes a fluid interrupter sleeve or FIS that stays in a bypass position while running in, providing a large flow area to circulate past the tool. Once drilling and any additional circulation is complete, the displacement can be started immediately. In some cases, chemicals and hydraulics are inefficient for removing traces of mud and solids and can require long periods of circulating and filtering. This can be addressed by making a short trip and mechanically cleaning the casing with a bristle tech brush. The bristle tech brushes are spaced out in the planning phase to ensure full mechanical cleaning coverage during the short trip. Cuttings and other debris can build up in the BOP during drilling and other operations. The short trip is an ideal time to run riser cleaning tools and perform jetting of the BOP to ensure the rams and high drill are clean. The large flow areas around and through the riser tools eliminates concerns of surging and swabbing while tripping, removing the need to limit trip speed. The riser bristle tech brush can be fitted with steel bristles or a synthetic bristle option the shape of the Vortec riser junk bucket allows fluid to speed up around the bucket. Fluid then slows at the top where debris separates from the flow path and falls into the bucket. The riser MagTech magnet and riser Vortec work to mechanically remove debris from the riser, where hydraulic removal of debris is the most difficult due to the large ID. All riser tools are non-rotational. With the JetTech valve positioned at the BOP, a single activation ball is pumped to the tool to begin jetting. The large nozzle flow area of the JetTech allows high pumping rates to assist in cleaning, and the offset position of the nozzles ensures that the JetTech can effectively clean the BOP with or without rotation. The sizing and distribution of the jet nozzles have been designed to achieve optimal impact force for debris removal, while avoiding damage to BOP components. Once jetting is complete, a second ball deactivates the tool and restores flow to the bit. With the short trip complete, solids suspended by the short trip can be circulated and filtered out of the hole quickly. As the string is pulled out of the hole, the FIS on the Valley Tech filter closes and forces all fluid and debris into the filter screen. Non-ferrous debris and debris that was unable to be circulated out is captured. If the ValleyTech filter becomes full, the self-functioning bypass is automatically activated so the string can continue to be pulled without swabbing the hole. 
The well is now clean and free for mud residues and solids. The cleaning string is tripped out and the well is ready for completion.